here in the i button and in description box below you will get complete playlist of Fourier series welcome to video number 14 and in this video we are going to solve a very 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 important problem on even and odd function okay yes in the given problem that is the question says find the Fourier series of the function f of x equals to e to the power minus mod of x in the interval that is minus pi to pi here you can see here you can see in the given problem nowhere it is asked this is uh, even function or odd function okay the question belongs to even function or odd function so we need to check whether this function is even function or odd function or neither of both okay yes when when to check whether the given function is even function or odd function or neither of both yes when the limit is from minus a to plus a here you can see the limit is given as minus pi to plus pi so in this problem we will check whether this function f of x is an even function or an odd function okay so before i move uh, forward i would request you to subscribe to my channel and if you learn something from my videos then please hit the like button and do share the playlist of uh, Fourier series with your friends okay in this way only you can support me and i really need your support so let us start solving solving this problem that is Find the Fourier series of the function that is f of x equals to e to the power minus mod of x equal in the given interval that is minus pi to plus pi. Okay, here yeah. the function is e to the power minus mod of x. Okay, yes. To check whether the given function is an odd function or even function, we will put e x equals to minus x. Okay, first we need to put x equals to minus x. If f of minus x is f of x, in that case the function f of x is even function. If on putting x equals to minus x f of minus x comes out to be minus of f of x in that case the given function is odd function okay so here on putting x equals to minus x f of minus x equals to e to the power minus mod of minus x okay yes since this negative is within this mod so this will be okay this can be removed because minus of mod of anything will be always positive okay yes so mod of mod of minus x can be written as mod of x okay so this is e to the power minus mod of x e to the power minus mod of x which is f of x here in the question itself it is given as f of x equals to e to the power minus mod of x okay so on putting x equals to minus x f of minus x is f of x so we can say that the given function f of x which is this is an even function okay yes and since the given function f of x okay is an even function so straight away we can say that is the value of bn will be zero okay it means we need to find only two values that is a naught and a n okay yes because they both are contained in the Fourier series so therefore the Fourier series of an even function is given by f of x equals to a naught upon 2 plus summation n equals to 1 to infinity a n into cos 2 n pi x upon b minus a what is b minus a let us see Yes, the interval is from minus pi to pi. So this is b, this is a, b minus of minus pi. Okay, b minus a, that is pi minus of minus pi will become 2 pi. Okay, so if you put here, it is 2 pi. Here, you can see b minus a equals to 2 pi. So f of x, that is a to the power minus mod of x equals to a naught upon 2 plus summation n equals to 1 to infinity cos an into cos of nx okay because 2 pi 2 pi will get cancelled here you are left with only nx so this is cos of nx and this is supposed to be my equation number one okay yes so we need to find two values only that is a naught and a n to find this value we will take the help of Euler's formula okay so first we will find what is a n let us start the formula is the general formula is 2 upon b minus a integration a to b f of x dx okay the general formula is 2 upon b minus a integration a to b f of x dx okay b minus a is how much 2 pi so simply write 2 pi so 2 2 will get cancelled here the integration okay a is minus pi b is pi f of x is e to the power minus of mod of x dx okay yes so 2 2 will get cancelled so we can write this as 1 upon pi now here Integration minus pi to pi can be written as 2 into integration 0 to pi. Okay. Yes. And this becomes e to the power minus mod of x will become e to the power minus x. Let us see how it becomes like this. Okay. Here. Okay. We need to see this. Okay. Yes. The given function f of x is e to the power minus mod of x. Okay. Yes. Here we need to break the limit. Okay. The limit is from minus pi to 0. Okay, the limit is from minus pi to 0. Here you can see the limit is from minus pi to, sorry, minus pi to plus pi. Okay, so here, here we need to divide 
this limit into two parts that is minus pi to 0 okay and the second is 0 to pi okay because here the function is e to the power mod of x because of this mod we will divide this into two okay that is minus pi to 0 and 0 to pi if the limit is if the range of x is from minus pi to 0 in that case this x okay this mod of x will become minus of x okay this x mod of x will become minus of x when the limit is from minus pi to 0 in that case mod of x will become minus of x okay yes now simply solve this you will get e to the power x it means function f of x will become e to the power x when the limit is from minus pi to 0 okay yes now if the limit is from minus pi sorry if the limit is from 0 to pi okay if the limit is from 0 to pi in that case mod of x will become plus x okay if the limit is from 0 to pi in that case the value of mod of x will become x so this is f of x equals to e to the power minus of x that is e to the power minus x okay so function f of x will become e to the power minus x when the limit is from 0 to pi okay and here we are using the limit as 0 to pi here you can see we are using that is limit equals to 0 to pi so here you can put okay yes as the limit is from 0 to pi so we will put f of x equals to e to the power minus x okay yes i think this part is very much clear to you yes so here we have e to the power minus x as the function okay now this will become 2 upon pi simply integrate this part that is e to the power minus x upon minus 1 okay the limit is from 0 to pi now if you put now here we can take this negative here that is 2 upon minus 2 upon pi simply put upper limit that is e to the power minus pi minus lower limit that is e to the power 0 okay yes now if you take this negative here this will become positive this will become negative so we can say 2 upon pi okay 2 upon pi into this is positive that is e to the power 0 that is how much 1 minus of e to the power minus pi okay and this is the final value of a naught okay this is the final value of a naught after this we will find a n by the help of Euler's formula okay let us try a n equals to 2 upon b minus a integration a to b f of x cos of 2 n pi x upon b minus a dx here we have 2 b minus a equals to 2 pi so 2 upon 2 pi integration value of a is minus pi value of b is pi f of x is e to the power minus mod of x cos of n x because b minus a is 2 pi so 2 pi 2 pi will get cancelled here we are left with only n into x dx okay now here again 2 2 will get cancelled so we are left with only 1 upon pi okay yes integration minus pi to pi can be written as 2 into integration 0 to pi okay when the limit is from 0 to pi in that case function becomes e to the power minus x this we have already discussed okay and this part is cos n x dx now here the integration is e to the power ax into cos bx dx so here we are going to use a very good formula that is integration e to the power ax into cos bx dx equals to e to the power ax into upon a square plus b square into a cos bx plus b sin bx okay let's suppose in the formula in the in the problem here we have sine okay that is integration e to the power ax into sin bx dx in that in, the, in that case this will be as it is that is e to the power ax upon a square plus b square a here we'll, we will have sign and here we will have cos and here we will have negative sign okay had this been sign this would have been sign this would have been cos and this would have been negative sign okay but here this is cos so use cos here sign and here we have a positive sign okay now if you compare this with this okay if you compare both you will get a equals to minus 1 and b equals to n okay so using this formula okay that is 2 upon pi as it is okay here we have e to the power what is a that is minus 1 so e to the power minus x upon minus 1 whole square that is 1 plus n square that is n square okay here we have minus sorry a is what minus 1 so minus cos what is b n okay minus cos n x plus n sin n x okay again again the limit is from 0 to pi now we will solve this in we will put limits simply put limits that is upper limit pi so here we can take this as common that is 1 plus n square so 2 upon 1 plus n square into pi okay this part is here now here if you put upper limit that is e to the power minus pi here okay minus cos of n pi plus n of sin n pi okay upper limit positive lower limit is negative so if you put 0 here this will become e to the power 0 here we will have minus of cos 0 plus n sin 0 okay here you can see sin of n pi is always 0 
yes that is sin series also is also zero okay yes so okay here you can see this part is as it is okay that is 2 upon 1 plus n square into pi now yes here you can see minus is as it is cos of n pi is minus 1 power n and here we have e to power minus pi okay now come here that is e to power 0 is 1 cos 0 is 1 so here we have minus 1 into negative that is plus 1 okay now this can be written as a naught equals to 2 upon 1 plus n square into pi 1 minus of minus 1 power n e to power minus pi so this is the final value of a n okay and we also have that is a naught equals to 2 upon pi into 1 minus e to power minus pi and since the given function is even function so we can say the value of pn is always 0 okay now we'll come to the equation number 1 what is my equation number 1 let us see that yes e to power minus mod of x equals to a naught upon 2 plus summation n equals to 1 to infinity a n into cos n x okay we have the value of a naught and a n okay so simply put this in equation number 1 we will get the desirable Fourier series okay so a naught equals to 2 upon pi into 1 minus e to power minus pi so in the formula we have a naught upon 2 so 2 2 will get cancelled so we are left with 1 minus e to power minus pi upon this pi okay plus in uh, this part okay this part of an we have 2 upon pi so 2 upon pi summation n equals to 1 to infinity 1 upon 1 plus n square into this part that is 1 minus of minus 1 power n e to power minus pi into cos n x okay and this is this is my final or you can say required for your series for the function that is e to power minus okay e to power minus of mod of x okay hope you have understood everything thank you thank you so much for watching this video thank you